Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. We are in deep shit, to be honest. Uh, we're gonna have to leave the moon and head to Earth. Because... Basically... There's nothing for us here, as there is no power. So... We're gonna have to be careful about it, because we don't have that much... Hydrogen. So, we're going to be very careful about getting out of here, I say, as I crash. Okay. Let's get out of here. Turn off our inertial dampeners. And we need to find home base. Okay. So home base is over here. We are out of planetary gravity, so we can hopefully do a jump. Uh, no, no, no. We need to jump. What was it? 100 and 160 or something? Yeah, 160. So, let's see, 156 will do, yes, that might be a little bit too long actually, but it's fine. I have absolutely no control. I think my gyros are gone. And I can't build one. My gyros are gone. Destroyed? No. This one is. Alright, but we do have one, so I should be able to. Yeah, here we go. Don't know why it wasn't reacting before. Turn the inertial dampeners off. And head towards home base. Man! Really did a number on the ship here. Home base will have power because it has wind power. So that shouldn't be a problem. Alright, we have planetary gravity. That's good. All we need to do is land safely, which I hope we can. We should be able to. It's been a while since we've been on Earth. It's been a while. Interesting to see what the base looks like. Ready. Ok, 
getting there, only 30 kilometers away. And then we'll have to repair the ship down here on Earth. And then we can head back to the moon and stick some uranium. So we need to process the uranium down here on Earth as well. And we can stick that in the base and then we'll have power in the base. I think we'll have to rebuild our uh, solar arrays on the moon as well. Because while uranium lasts a long time, it's, it's not infinite. It's not infinite power. Which is basically what we need. So yeah. Just be a little while. Right, I'll uh, get a little bit closer and then I'll be back. See you in a few. Alright, we are almost at the base. Sky hover for a little bit. And we can open our mask now, which is nice. And we'll move one of these. I'm not sure which one. They're, they're both they both look like they have something that needs repairing. hit that. And sit in the ship instead of fly into the ship and die. It didn't go the way I wanted to. Let's turn around. And we'll take a look behind us.
Siren locked. Okay. We're locked on. Now, power. Uh, is this refinery on top? Yes, so. Yeah. Meteor storm inbound. Oh, another one. it out. And the block is on. You are completely inside now. Good. being repaired now. Yeah, it is. Good. Good, good, good. Why are you still on? There's one... two engines still on. Two thrusters still on. Okay. Storm inbound. I guess they were damaged, that's why they were on. Oh, that was a meteor storm. It's heading right for us, man. Okay, so our ship is being repaired, which is good. So, 
What's broken on this guy? components and steel plates. Well, the meteor has taken out our leg there. on them. Meet there. Okay. So next, I want to see. I have a bit of ice in here, just a little bit. So if we can get a connection on this, then we can move a ton of ice. Real easy. Up here, I have a ship down here as well. It's my welding ship. maintenance down here. That's not the plan right now. Let's have a look here. I don't remember what I have here. We sequencers. survival kit. Do we have it on here somewhere? I'm guessing no. Clean armor. 
Some food stuffs. Yep. Here we don't have anything yet. Okay. made some weird stuff here. Uh, I need some... I do have some materials and lights. So let's just see if we can't get a conveyor on this thing. Conveyor, conveyor. Does it connect to the cargo container? No. It did once. Looks like. All right. Construction components into here. Um, let's take all this off. Too late. Hydrogen again. Stop. 
now. Oops. Almost killed myself again there. So we'll turn. that are around here because of all the uh, meteor strikes. Bit of ice here, just a tad. I wonder if we can take off with all of that ice on board. How much do we weigh now? Six million kilos. I kind of doubt it. I doubt it. I'm not gonna risk it. So... We're gonna... be able to take off with that. No problem. Oh, we weighed that much because we are connected to the other thing as well.
thing. And all the ice should go into the H2O2 generators now. Are you guys working? Full. Um, well, one of them is full, the other one is getting there. These are actually quite full as well. Nice. these are filling up when this is not full and this is on oh it's not on stockpile that's why it should be on stockpile all right so we're actually full on hydrogen now not bad and our ship is in one piece for now at least Ready to head back to the moon. to the moon already but we'll make that decision in the next one because we are out of time for this one but uh, yeah our ship is fully functional again and oh we can't head back to the moon until our uranium has been processed so we'll see about that in the next one so thank you very much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you next time <laughs>